Libertarian Gary Johnson set out to show he is the fittest candidate for president this morning and got quite the workout in the process, bicycling all the way from Taos to a rally on the Santa Fe Plaza this afternoon. News 13, So Young Kim reports. It was a mixed crowd as Libertarian presidential candidate Gary Johnson campaigned in his home state for the second weekend in a row. It's really cool. It's just a big name coming to town, and so it's, uh, it's awesome to see him out here. Some came to Johnson's rally at Santa Fe Plaza undecided. Just principally, the idea that we ought to have a third voice in American politics is really exciting. Others already know and love Johnson. Worked on both of his gubernatorial campaigns, and... Uh, I just, just think he's a wonderful person, a very intelligent, knowledgeable, smart, honest, and decent person. The former two-time New Mexico governor stuck to the same game plan he has throughout his campaign trail, stressing why he believes it's so important for voters to have an alternative to the two front runners. I hope to ruin the party for both of them. Uh, this is a, this is a two-party system that needs crashing. This morning, Johnson hit the campaign trail quite literally. He biked for more than 70 miles from his home north of Taos all the way to Santa Fe Plaza. Life is about health and wellness and it's really important. This was all in an effort to prove he's fittest to be the next president of the United States. Fiance, um, we wrote it all together today. I know there hasn't been a president and first lady in the history of the United States that could have done that ride today in six hours. And he says the ride was also a salute to his home state. Just really a celebration of New Mexico. It is fall, and I'm an athlete. Thank you all very, very much. Thank you. So Young Kim, KRQE News 13. Johnson will be campaigning in Virginia next. The latest polling here in New Mexico puts him in a strong third place behind Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump.